The Chicago Park District is sending an SOS. The agency needs more lifeguards and is now making a rather enticing offer. Brona Tumulty is live at uh, Foster Beach with more. Brona. Good evening, guys. Yeah, 58 degrees is obviously not the ideal day for heading to the beach, but give it a week or 10 days, and I'm sure this beach behind me here at Foster will be teeming with people. Chicagoans will flock down here, I'm sure, for Memorial Day weekend, which is, of course, the unofficial start of summer. And the good news is, I was chatting earlier with Superintendent of the Chicago Parks District, Rosa Escarino, who tells us today we do have enough lifeguards to staff the city's 27 beaches here on the lakefront for the Memorial Day weekend. However, the issue is really more about what happens when the city's pools, about 70 of them in total, are supposed to open on June 24th. Now, that's also when the summer camps for the city, which deal with about 14,000 kids, kick off as well. Now, we weren't able to get any specific numbers from the Park District on how many more lifeguards are needed to fully and safely staff all of the beaches and the pools this summer, but they tell us they will have a better idea of how things are looking for the pool situation in a few weeks from now. We'll have a better idea on June 24th because we're not closing our application process. We're going to keep it open as long as possible because our goal is to open as many, uh, if not all our pools, but as many pools as possible. Now, we did learn that overall about 2,100 seasonal workers are hired each year by the Parks Department. They all earn roughly $15 to $16 an hour, and a $200 bonuses are now going to be an offer for most workers with lifeguards getting about $500 uh, in those bonuses. If you've already started an application with the Parks District to come on board as a lifeguard, they're hoping that you will complete that application. If you haven't started one and you're a little bit more interested now, you can find the link for that up on our website site under this story. Live at Foster Beach, Brona Tumulty, WGN News. Thank you, Brona.